It was introduced by the Iranian-American chemist Aliyev Takari. The device used the potassium compound Prussian blue as the cathode material for its high electrochemical stability. The prototype was successfully used for millions of cycles. The potassium battery has certain advantages over similar lithium batteries. The cell design is simple and both the material and the fabrication procedure are cheaper. The prototype employed a KBF4 electrolyte though almost all common electrolyte salts can be used. The chemical diffusion coefficient of K plus in the cell is higher than that of Li plus in lithium batteries, due to a smaller Stokes radius of solvated K plus. Since the electrochemical potential of K plus is identical to that of Li plus, the cell potential is similar to that of lithium ion. Potassium batteries can accept a wide range of cathode materials which can offer rechargeability lower cost. One noticeable advantage is the availability of potassium graphite, which is used as an anode material in some lithium ion batteries. Its stable structure guarantees a reversible intercalation, der intercalation of potassium ions under charge, discharge. In 2005, a potassium battery that uses molten electrolyte of KPF6 was patented. In 2007, Chinese company Starsway Electronics marketed the first potassium battery-powered portable media player as a high-energy device. Potassium batteries have been proposed for large-scale energy storage given its exceptional cycle ability. Researchers demonstrated a potassium air battery with low overpotential. Its charge-discharge potential gap of about 50 mV is the lowest reported value in metal-minus air batteries. This provide round-trip energy efficiency of greater than 95%. In comparison, the O2 batteries have a much higher overpotential of 1 minus 1.5 V, which results in 60% round-trip efficiency.